So what are we doing today, Lincoln? What's this adventure all about? Well, we're not involved in this one. This is this is a weird one. This is. This is a. This is Sarah's adventure. This one. This one will be the adventure of a lifetime. Ryan, well, she's already come across by land from uh, London to Japan, and the next stage of her trip is from here. And she hopes to get to Canada. Okay, Mark. <laughs> Going all the way to Canada in the rowboat. Look at that. How far are you going, Mark? I'm going to Vancouver, I hope. Vancouver? I'm strapped into my cabin, and I've got two guys going to pull on the boat on the outside, and we're going to do a roll test. So, let's see. Okay! Ready? Go! <laughs> so you have to pull on that other rope to get it to go 360. The one that's just on its edge on it, that, that's the one. I'm exhausted. I want to ride inside oh, next time. Okay. <laughs> Somebody else pull it over. <laughs> All right. We're ready, Captain. Bring on the storm. Wow. This is an incredible voyage. She's going across the Pacific. Sarah Uden. I am uh, playing the part of her in the harness. Yeah, it's, I don't know. I'm starting to feel a little queasy. Oh, oh my. Oh my. Where's the barf bag? No barf bags in here, Sarah? Oh, goodness. The crew's a little slow outside there, capsizing the boat. I think I'll just take a little nap here. I was up kind of early this morning. A two-hour ride, bike ride to get down to this marina. Here we go. Look at these. these guys are working hard out here. How about a big round of applause for the capsizers? <laughs> go, guys, go! Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was five times out on the Indian. Yeah, five I was, cap sizes. Yeah, five cap sizes. I was outside for the first one, so the boat flipped around again, and I was hanging over the edge of the boat on my lifeline, and the line had got caught around that bit where the oar goes, so uh, I had to undo the line to get back on the boat. And then the next time was at night. I was woken up with a rude bump in the night, and then the last three times were at the very end, capsizing onto a coral reef in the Mauritius, which wasn't so Crunch. Good. Yeah, exactly. But here you are today. Survive to tell the tale. Preparing for another adventure, bigger, yeah. better, stronger. I, I reckon it might happen again on the Pacific. London to London, that's the name of the mission. And the mission is to use only human power to do a full loop around planet Mars, I mean Earth. Yep, so what's the plan? By making two solo ocean rows, that's 7,500 nautical miles, 11 months at sea, three continents by bicycle, 300 miles by kayak, for a total of 20,000 miles, 14 countries, 850 days of adventure, six to 8,000 calories a day. Let's eat. <laughs> Currently, Sarah is rowing across the Pacific from Japan to Vancouver. I'll put a link to her website down below if you're interested in following her progress. She does regular radio updates as well as blog entries. 
and there's also a map on there with the GPS coordinates uh, plotting where she goes every day. So check it out. And I hope this video inspires you to get out there and have more adventure in your life. I know it has for me because I'm doing a 26 mile full marathon on June 1st. And I'll probably be doing a video of that as well. So in closing, I would like to say bon voyage, Sarah. I hope you have a great adventure. I hope you arrive safely in Vancouver and good luck.